Applying for UK visa is already a troublesome process, but have you ever wondered why it is considered difficult and complex? Did you know that sometimes applicants make blunders which causes the delays or maybe rejections? Please support us by subscribing to our channel and share the video with your friends and family. So today we are going to talk about Ordinary causes for UK visa rejections Are you planning to apply for a UK visa? If your answer is yes, then it is in your finest welfare to escape common errors which might be the reason for your visa refusal. But what are the usual motives that direct towards UK visa applications being rejected? When your visa application is rejected, it may be annoying, unclear, and disturbing for you. But the fact is that UK visa rejection is not a random issue, it's an ordinary event. Owing to this, it is very vital that you evade all ordinary and simple errors to begin with. To make this procedure stress-free, we are mentioning some of the extremely common explanations for the rejection of UK visa applications. Appeal a UK visa refusal judgment. You were unable to provide the accurate paperwork. It is extremely essential that you provide all the proper paperwork required for a visa application. Various visa types need various arrays of paperwork or credentials as proof to be presented. When you are submitting your visa application, it is vital that you provide credentials relevant to your visa type. Accurate paperwork would deliver the essential proof for your UK visa application. With a UK spouse visa, for instance, you must provide proof of your relationship. This entails specific documentations and credentials, such as proof that your funds are mutually shared in a joint bank account. If you fail to deliver this paperwork it can lead to your visa application being denied, as it proposes that your bond is not authentic. You did not provide paperwork in the precise layout. Together with providing the right papers, it is also obligatory that you provide the credentials in the precise format. Don't just send the credentials in packages, they have to be well prepared. You have to adjust them in the proper, sequential order and hand over them exactly as necessary. There can be exact evidence absent in your visa application. When you go through the actual website of the Home Office, you may browse through their guidance to be quite naive and direct. But then again you must recognize that these are only common sketches and don't propose sufficient facts. You cannot neglect essential facts like a date or a primary copy of an authorized paperwork as it may direct to your UK visa denial. You did not pursue professional guidance and followed assistance from friends. If you believe that just analyzing from the website of the Home Office or by inquiring friends, it is unproblematic for you to fill in the application form properly, submit paperwork which are compulsory in the obligatory format and instructions, then you may be mistaken. In the end, your relatives or friends are not likely to be authorized immigration specialists. You must inquire the specialists as they understand the essentials of the UK visa and immigration when it's about applying for a UK visa. You believed that the Home Office will be kind. Don't make the blunder of taking the Home Office for granted, considering it would disregard some of your minor mistakes, it might not. The facts shows this also, with the vast figures of visa applications denied per annum. You did not reveal prior issues. If you have had a prior immigration or legal matters, including criminal imprisonment, then don't try to bury this fact. If there is a prohibition or you have spent time for a particular criminal sentence, then don't be under the impression that you can bury the fact from the Home Office, they ignore nothing and inquire about the whole situation. Deliberately not disclosing prior issues can also block you from applying for alternative visa in the future, as it appears you are trying to mislead the Home Office. You submitted the application for the wrong visa category. It is vital that you apply for the precise visa category, as each are intended for the numerous reasons of immigration. You were unsuccessful in the English language test. For the huge mass of UK visas, you are required to attain a precise English language test. Ideally, the least required score is B1, but in many circumstances it can be the higher score of B2. If you can't to archive these obligations, it is possible that your visa will be denied. You must stay away from such blunders so that the Home Office does not reject your visa application. And whenever you submit your visa application you have to pay the obligatory fee whether it is fruitful or not. It is even more significant that you don't make any of the ordinary blunders mentioned in this video. To find out more about this, 
log on to our website. We hope you liked the video. Please don't forget to hit the like button and share this video on your Facebook, WhatsApp and Twitter. Thanks for watching.